tiles that cross the ocean, historic center of Sao Luis. Sao Luis is the capital city of the Maranhão state in Brazil. It is located on the confluence of two rivers just below the equator. It was the only French colonial town in Brazil at the beginning of the 17th century. The town was named after the French king, Louis XIII. This is the Palacio dos Leos, the Lion's Palace. It was built in a neoclassical style by the French in 1612. The palace is surrounded by robust stone walls. France was trying to establish a strong fortress in the area. However, in just three years, the town was seized by the Portuguese during their colonial expansion in Brazil. The Portuguese proceeded to rebuild the town in a completely different style. These tall, narrow, rounded entrances and decorative bay windows are characteristic of the Portuguese architectural style. Buildings decorated in beautiful wall tiles are of particular interest. They are known as azulejo in Portugal. The tiles reflect the sunlight, reduce heat and are resistant to rain and wind damage. San Luis thrived on sugar and cotton exports. People wished to recreate their homeland here using the wealth gained from overseas trade. The houses of some wealthy Portuguese families still remain today. The homes are decorated with the finest tiles. This was a way to show off their wealth. The people of this town are trying to restore traditional tile-making techniques. A school to teach the techniques was founded with state funds. Each tile is hand-painted glazed and kiln dried. Finished tiles are used to restore old buildings in the town. These old buildings are still in a poor state of repair. However, the process of replacing each tile means that these wonderful buildings are regaining some of their sparkle. This town of tiles is regaining its past beauty thanks to the hard work of the young people of this town.